I've never had to start an appointment this way. I don't really know what the mom's thinking. The bride is pretty shattered. And I would think that as a mother, you would pick up my, maybe on those subtle hints, like her bawling. To please her family, Shauna agrees to come out in the second dress. Oh, Mom, I'm watching you. Mom, are you crying? I got a little teary-eyed, but I love it. It's beautiful. It is. I saw my daughter in the one dress. The tears came. It's less edgy and funky than I would have expected, so I'm quite pleased. Oh, it looks great. What do you think? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. It's one thing to have the entire family love a wedding dress, but when it comes down to it, the bride has to be 100% certain that this is her dress. Do you love this dress, Shona? I just don't know. I love that ha hair thing. It really ties it together. Do you think that this might be the dress you might want to walk down the aisle in? I think being one of those girls who doesn't ever dream of their wedding and have it all picked out in their head, so to actually feel bridal, it's very strange. I might pass out. OK. I felt like anxious. It's just, it's weird. It's really weird. <sighs> I feel like I'm going to throw up. Please don't do that. <laughs> I don't want to try anything else on. Listen, you're not a shopper. I know, I want to get it off. Panicked, Shauna heads back to the dressing room. Definitely. I think it's, it's, it's overwhelming. She does not want to be here. All right, I'm taking this bad boy off. Oh my god, I'm about to get married and be someone's wife, and I'm a bride. <sighs> I just want to get a normal clothes. <laughs> I think that was the feeling that made me maybe a little nauseous, a little butterfly, a little anxiety. Oh, it's too much. And I think you know yourself. I know. I know, that's what I'm saying. Everyone was expecting me to have the, oh my god, this is the one feeling, which I haven't had. There is a lot of pressure. My mother really wanted, you know, to go to Kleinfeld's, and, and I'll be happiest to get the shopping over with. Did I give you guys enough time? Oh, yes. I don't want to dress shop anymore. I don't want to try on other dresses. It's not that I don't think I just... I don't want you to buy a dress unless you feel comfortable about making the purchase. So we'll take it off. Give me a hug. Aww. I dread shopping anyway, and because I'm not the traditional bride, I'm hesitating right now. I just need to think about it. Sometimes brides get really freaked out because they didn't even want this big wedding, and they catch themselves just kind of going through the motions to please the family. <sighs> You're gonna have fun at your wedding. I know. And I don't want to put on another dress ever. You need to have a wedding that you love, and not just a wedding that everyone else is just expecting you to have. Bride Shauna leaves this store empty-handed. The next day, she calls off the big wedding in Pennsylvania and is planning a small island ceremony with only her closest family. After nine dresses, Michelle finally figures out she wants a combination of simplicity and sparkle. Dress 10 has both. Out of everything, mm -hmm. this is on the top of the list. Pretty darn good. Eight and a half. Eight and a half? Not there. even a, look at how good you look. You know, Michelle's body in that panina gown just looked unbelievable. She just looked like a beautiful woman in that dress. Love it. And it make it look like you got a booty. It's gorgeous. But does Michelle feel the same? Did we find the dress? No. I'm, I want to be sure, like, I want to say, okay, I'm done. After all the dresses trying on, the final dress that I tried on was the one that I liked the most. But it was, still wasn't a wow, this is my dress moment. So I can always come back. Okay, so. Hey, let's see, got somewhere. Somewhere. <laughs> Michelle tried on a lot of dresses. But I think in the end, she really did kind of learn what she liked and what she didn't like. I'm about to start crying. Don't do that. There are tissues <laughs> right behind you. You know, I started crying at your way. Oh, you're really crying? Don't <laughs> do that. No. Give your brother a hug. Aww. You know, she's not easily defeated. I think she'll find the dress eventually. Yeah, that dress over there is beautiful. What do you think about that dress over there, Mom? That dress in black would be amazing. Black? I hope you want what you were black, no. I have tried on literally 100 dresses, and it's very difficult for me to find a dress because I don't want to wear a white dress, but my mom wants me to wear a white dress. So every single dress shop that I've went to, my mom has definitely jeopardized 
the dress that I like because she wants me to wear white and I do not want to wear white. Are you the bride? Yes, I am. Randy, nice to meet you. Hi, Welcome Randy. to Kleinfeld. And who do you have with you? My Her mom, mom. Yeah. and this is my dad. Dad, it's, yeah, it's a pleasure. It's, it's a pleasure as well. It's my pleasure. So how's everything going? What's going um, on? My mom, she called my fiance and had informed him to come Guilty. for the appointment. Come to Kleinfeld. She's going to try on some dresses, so just come and surprise her. All right, bye. I hope he yeah. said no. Oh, you no. shouldn't have done that. She has done this for every single appointment. And I told her that this appointment, he cannot be present for. I really need to find my dress. Yeah. I can't, I just okay. can't believe, I can't yeah, believe she did that. that. <laughs> I've never had to start an appointment this way. I don't really know what the mom's thinking. The bride is pretty shattered. And I would think that as a mother, you would pick up my, maybe on those subtle hints, like her bawling. Why are you inviting the fiance? Because he wants to see her dress. He just want to peek. Her fiance likes the traditional white dress too. So I wanted him to tell her, no, she's not going to have no black dress at the wedding at all, period. A black dress, I don't think that's appropriate. It doesn't look like a wedding dress. You want her to be happy, right? Yes, definitely, 100%. And you want her to find so, a dress? Yes. A Queen okay. Elizabeth nice white poofy dress. I'm like, not a white dress. Let's try to turn this into a happy moment. You're in a good place now, Kleinfeld. Okay. <laughs> My mother doesn't get it. My mother wants what she wants, and I feel like she betrayed me by contacting him. I don't want to get her upset. Okay, hang on. Um, she is. I'll call Tracy and tell him don't come. I, 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 I'll call, okay? All right. I'll call. So it sounds to me like mom doesn't want Tracy to be wearing black, and neither does the fiance. So mom's trying to rope her fiance into this appointment, which is really unfair to Tracy, and it, it almost feels like mom is more concerned about herself than she is her daughter. No, this is not a place you want to come to right now. Trust you me. He's not coming, Tracy. He's not coming. Tell me what I can do to make this all right. I want a pretty dress. OK, well, honey, we got 1,800 of them. <laughs> OK. <laughs> let's, let's start from the beginning. Tell me a little about your wedding. Or, or you know what? I think I need to bring in James, because he's going to be your consultant. OK. Mom? Mm -hmm. You can put her outside, yes, right please. Put her outside. <laughs> Today, I'm going to get the dress that I want, and the dress is going to be purple gold, red, or black. Maybe they can find us some black for me. I'm gonna have a heart attack in this place. Black. No funeral. Holy train. No. That's huge. I want you ladies to know <laughs> she uttered the word love five times on this dress. Oh, oh my now, God. Now this yeah. is the dress. I love it, but it's, I don't like it. You don't Nothing. like this? No. Should we turn you around, Samantha? What don't you like about it? It's too much layers. I'll grab the train. Thanks, Randy. Oh, there you go. Sam. I love it. She I... loves it. Why? No, I don't like it. Is yeah, that... this is, no. This is the dress you liked on the mannequin. I love that dress, it's so pretty. Love that top. Yeah, not on Samantha. It's too much. I picked the dress because I seen it on the mannequin. It looked different. But on her, it, it's ugly. I don't like it. OK, you like it? She How do you did. Feel? How do you feel, <laughs> Samantha? Look at her face. I'm looking at my face because it's the way you are right now. Because I don't like it. It's too much, a lot of layers, man. It's too I like much. it because it's big. You know, exactly. I like big dresses. This is it? But it could be one piece. We can you do can that. This is a lot piece. of layers. So is that the only thing holding you back? Yeah. Why don't I have the designer come out and meet you, Samantha? Okay. And she can make some suggestions, too. OK. I feel like this is my dress. This is the one. And I really want my mom to love this dress. Panina? I feel like it's a dress that makes a statement. Like, when you walked up here, I literally went, wow. Yeah. And that's what you're going for, right? Yeah. I didn't say wow. wow. I don't know how you don't, don't roll love your this. eyes. I, I didn't roll my eyes. Go ahead, your I'll mom's going to kill me by the end of this weekend. I'll roll my <laughs> eyes for you. OK? <laughs> I'm more concerned with what you think. 
Oh, she's so sweet. But it's your day. I'm so glad you're here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but I mean, your mom's right. You look beautiful in anything. I mean, Say dresses, it again, your mom is. You're, your mom's right. <laughs> you're, you're absolutely right. But the fact is, she said she feels beautiful in this. I don't like it. I'm sorry. Samantha, lady, <laughs> this is Panina Tournay. Thank you well, so I love nice. your outfit. Hi, I'm her Hi, mom. Hi, Diana. I love your outfit. <laughs> yeah, I love Thank it. You. So, mom isn't loving the lace. I said we could do it in one clean. Absolutely, that's very easy for right. me and to do. And then the other option I was saying is, see, I mean, if she wants, she could do either a strap yeah. or she could do like off the shoulder too. Yeah. That's, Ooh, pretty. that's pretty. Mom, in the bridal world, you need imagination. <laughs> you know that. I don't have one. <laughs> do we have a skirt that we can just put on top? Yeah, I have to see it without. <laughs> see? Just to give you the idea. So what do you think, Mom? Yeah. Can I borrow your outfit? <laughs> Diana, we're not shopping for you. I actually love Panina's outfit. I mean, it's gorgeous. I wasn't looking at Samantha's dress anymore. I'm looking at Panina's outfit. The one with the oh, wow. I love the off the shoulder. Yes. Yeah, See? that's it's beautiful. beautiful. Really but what pretty. don't you love? Because we can create a dress it's gorgeous. just for it you. Is. I don't know. I think she really loves this one. I think she really does. I'm afraid she's starting to doubt it now because of Diana. Yeah. What changed so drastically from the reaction you had in the room coming out like, here? I feel like my mom. Because your mom. I, lo I loved it. I loved it. Loved it. Duh. Yeah. Loved. loved. Duh. Duh. Listen, you're the one who's going to be yeah. wearing this dress for your most important event in life. So it has to be what your what you heart love. feels. Mm -hmm. Can we try something else? Because I'm like it. What? I wish she could have said at least something nice to her daughter. Thank you, Panina. I feel like maybe I need to find Samantha a dress that looks exactly like my outfit. Maybe then the mother will have something nice to say. You like it? I'll pay for it and let's go. Do you want it? I can just feel the love in the room. Yeah. I'm asking, listen. No, it was the way you're saying it. All right, I'll just pay for it, but I and hate let's it, go. and let's okay. go. Do you want it? No. You don't like it. Don't worry about me. I'm not going to wear it. You are. Do you want the dress? No. If you like it, get it. OK, thank you. I okay. don't like it. You want me to lie? OK, beautiful dress, Samantha. I love it. <laughs> I can't. I'm laughing. I can't. I thought it was uncalled for to, to laugh at her in the dress. I was appalled. I really was. I was appalled. I'm going to cover my face. <laughs> it's funny because she's like very mad. I don't care what you wear. I just want to get a dress, pay for it, and leave. I'm hungry. I want to go eat. <laughs> you want it? No, I don't want it. You're going to talk about my dress the whole entire day and the no, time. No, I won't. I promise. I won't open my mouth. You think she will? Come you on, think Samantha, she's going to laugh serious? about it? Yeah. You, you think you she's going to laugh? She was, you, she was laughing. Look at her right now. She's, because you're talking. What do you want to do? What do you mean? You, like, everything's a joke. Are you serious? I'm going to be talking. I, 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 I'm going to step away. Oh, my God, I'm going to be talking about your dress. Are you serious? I have serious? to step away. I, I, I don't want to be a part of this oh anymore. Oh gosh, I feel so I, bad I, for this you girl. You know what, can I tell you something? I feel so bad for this girl. It would be a dream of mine to have children. How could you ever treat your child this way? I, I'm really that upset. I didn't want to stay in the appointment any longer. Because how could you treat your child that way? It's horrid. Did you hear when she said, I'll just pay for it? She smirked. It was, it was, it was, it was I wanted to leave at that moment. You look so defeated and it's breaking my heart. I just want to take it off. She's right. Her mom's going to be talking about this dress at the wedding and how much she hates it. And she will. It's just awful. To treat your daughter that way, I, I, I can't imagine. I don't know how she's holding up. I honestly don't. To have gone to 81 stores now, and she finally found a dress that she's happy in, and for her mother to mock her, it's really sad. Yeah, honey. And turn around. I feel so bad. I'm sorry. Oh my God. It's gorgeous.
You're not even looking at yourself in the mirror. I, don't know. I just want to take it off. Okay. All right. I'll take this for you. Thanks, Randy. Okay. All right. Come on, honey. Let me get the train. Should we try on the other dress? Try on the other one. I'm feeling really upset, really down. I was so excited to come and, you know, find the dress, and I thought I did, but I can't walk down the aisle, you know, knowing that she doesn't like it or she thinks I could have did better. It would just kill me. I've been struggling my whole life to stand up for myself, tell my mom, hey, this is what I want. This is probably why it's been really hard to purchase a dress. What's up? What don't you like about this dress? Samantha, it's too much. No, this one is no. You want me to, I mean, you want me to fake it? You want right, me to I'm lie to you? I'm getting married in five months. Like, what do you want me to do? Okay, I don't like, I'm sorry, I don't like it. What do you like? You you said that you like this one. You told her to pick it out. Well, I didn't, okay, it looked different on you. I'm sorry, it's ugly. Okay, it's ugly. And you know what? I'm sorry, but I don't like the one you're trying on now. I'm sorry. Do you like this? No. Can we see something else? No, I'm done. I don't want to try more. We don't have time. Yes? Oh, hi. Hi. So How's we're just checking in on you two, ladies. Can I ask a question? Yes. Okay. What is the one thing that you want for your daughter? I want her to be happy. Did this make you happy? What are we, what's the, what's the roadblock here? I want you to love the dress. I cannot imagine you walking with this dress. This one, no. Sorry. I know you're saying, I wish you didn't come with me, but what am I gonna do? Could you grow to love it in her race? I'm right uh, here. You see me? I'm right here. I didn't know you're looking at me. You're supposed to be looking at the camera. No, I'm not. I feel like I'm never gonna find a dress. You know, at some point, you have to think about not disappointing Samantha. Come here, I'm gonna give you a hug, okay? Whose side is Randy on? I've, he's on my side. Tell me. Randy's on my side. On her side. Yes. I think everyone is on my side here. Yeah, because I'm the evil mom in here. Yep. I wish you luck. Thank you. Need me? I'm here. Okay. Okay. I think. <laughs> you feel so pretty. Like, so pretty. Is this everything you imagined? I, I really, oh, I really love it. Oh, I'm loving this dress. Like, I look smoking, I think. Whoa. Oh, Randy. Yeah, it's so beautiful. It's the country chic I was looking for. It's, it's just, it's, it's beautiful. Is there anything you don't love about it? No, I, I don't see anything. <laughs> I don't see anything that I don't love about it. So let's turn you around and let yes. your entourage see. <laughs> the pedestal, there you go. Look at you guys. <laughs> You're happy, <laughs> and that makes me happy. I like how it fits on you. Um, that's all I like about it, to be honest. Wait, what? Listen, I'm sorry I'm not gonna do what Kristen's doing and say that it's cute just because. It's like, that's rude, she looks beautiful. I, I like it, I just don't love it. Well, it's, it's traditional, it's romantic. Is that, what is it? A showstopper? A, a smoke I'm show. So, I'm sorry. <laughs> I just feel like you kind of blend in with every other bride. I just, I don't know what to say. I, I honestly, love this I love dress. it. I love you didn't, there it. There was but... nothing you didn't like about this dress. No. She's a little bit more daring than this. I feel like Sarah, and I don't want to start anything, and I'm sorry, and I know that we have been bumming heads, but I feel like Sarah is thinking more about what she would wear, and that's not what this is about. She obviously likes it. Is it something that you really like? I do like I do like this dress, but I get Bentley's point. This feels See, very yeah. like cookie cutter bride. Yeah. Now you're like getting all up in my head. Yeah. <laughs> She's gonna look beautiful in anything, I think is the challenge. Well, it's you not... didn't think that about the last dress. You are being very selfish in your opinions. I'm a little hurt by that. It's always been what your family would think, or it's too much, or whatever, and it's frustrating me. And it's also hard because Kristen has no real opinion, so it's just she's sitting here and it's just like... Oh, that is rude. I don't normally do this, but I think I'm gonna have to step in. You guys are really bringing a lot of drama to the table. This is not the experience that, that she deserves. This is not appropriate. Okay. Okay? 
We are Team Bride. We're here to help you find a dress, and this is not the path that I'm going to allow them to take you down. Sorry, Randy. I feel like Dad scolded us. <laughs> too. Okay. Mm. I don't necessarily feel like it's me. Like, I mean, it's it, me, but... Well, that's interesting because before you we turned you around, I did, I, you loved everything about it. I do love everything about it. Do you think that you're... Maybe, I, maybe they got in my head, I'm yeah. not sure. I think we need to pull, pull a few more. And then maybe go back to this if you want to. Yeah. Okay, okay. Oh, oh I'm just a little overwhelmed. Yeah. Don't be, don't be. No, it's good. It's all right. <laughs> I'm so stressed out. I, I need a dress. I'm just a little overwhelmed. I can't believe that they would do this on my appointment. I, I'll, I'll just, now, I, now it's tainted. Like, I just, I don't even know, you know? I think I'm a little overwhelmed at this point, and I don't know if I'm going to find a dress today. I... Don't know if I even want to leave the dressing room again. Wow, that's really pretty. It's a lot lighter than the other lace. Mm -hmm. I honestly have no idea how they're feeling right now. Okay. I think Randy scared their like bejesus out of them. What do you think? I like this one a lot. It's beautiful. Um, it still feels a little bit like maybe not exactly what I would want. But you're right, it has that little bit of a unique factor to it. It's really pretty. Like, I, I think you look absolutely stunning. Are you just saying this because you know that I was freaking out before and cried and I don't cry? Or are you guys actually really liking this dress? I feel like it's, it's a combination yeah. where it gets into the uniqueness. It's different. It's not a doily or grandma's quilt as you And you're say. okay with the top? I don't want you to, like, have opinions later. I mean, maybe if it was covered a little bit, like a true sweetheart as opposed to a plunge. <laughs> I still love the first dress the most. Like right. that one. Of course. Yes. Of course. <laughs> Bentley was always going to love that dress. Is this the wow factor that you want? I, I don't know. I don't know. There's something inside of me that just won't say the words. I just don't know why I didn't have that moment. And it's a little frustrating. You have to feel beautiful in this. Yeah. You're I just, not feeling anything right now. I'm, I'm not. I think I'm just a little overwhelmed. If you don't feel it or you're yeah. feeling overwhelmed, then I, I say... I just think there's just, like, too, too much. Too much today. Yeah. Okay. Then you know what? It might be time for you to take a break then. I'm also, like, just overly stressed that, like... Yeah. It's all coming up. Yeah. Yeah. It's... It's a lot. Well, I don't want you to be stressed <laughs> know, at all. I know. At all. And I'm sorry. This is a happy time. I know. Don't be sorry. It's not... <laughs> you know. We didn't make you stressed. No. <laughs> She pushes my buttons. He pushes my buttons. And um, it's, okay, fine. We push each other's buttons. That's and we it. have always. And I think that we should have been more prepared for this. Thank you. You're no, welcome. you're welcome. Um, here, hold on to that. Thank you. Okay. I, I want to be 100% sure that it's the dress. Uh, if anything, I'll come back and try it on by myself. I hope that you'll come back for it. Yeah, I really do love it. It was just, it was a lot to take. And I, it might have affected today's decision, but... At the end of the day, I, I just need to be 100% sure, and I wasn't. 